What's poppin' everybody? This is Sabre Finding 4. The time has finally come to open a One Piece booster box. Shout out to Alpha Training Card Games for hooking me up with a Kingdoms of Intrigue booster box. As much as I would like to open, you know, the first sets too, like Romance Dawn and um, P Pillars, P Pillars of War, I think. And uh, what's the second one? Paramount War. You know, just start from the beginning. Um, we can't be picky with One Piece sets these days, and um, rumor has it they're not going to reprint them. They're just going to do like a tin or like some sort of product with loose packs. But I hope, I hope that's wrong, and we are going to get more reprints. But anyway, my goal is to open just everything as much as I can, just at least one box from every set. As uh, I'm a One Piece fan, I want to collect the cards and build decks too. So this set is kind of cool, you know, it has the theme of uh, Kingdoms, which is basically the Alabasta Kingdom arc and the uh, Dressrosa arc, you could say. And uh, it's not too many cards that would benefit my Blue Crocodile deck, but we are going to open it up and hope for some good results. Okay, so here goes. Yeah, I even cut a little hole in it. It's still a pain to get rid of the shrink wrap. Anyway, let's put you... Let's put you here. And... Do this like it would be in the store. And should I just take the packs out? I'm just gonna... Uh, take them out one by one. Okay. So normally I cut them up with scissors off screen, you know, the Bandai sets, that, that's what I did with Digimon, but I've been told that you do this and it opens easy. Okay, so it's easy. You open it from the side like that. Still got to put in some effort, but okay. Yeah, this, this isn't that effective. Anyway. I'm really rusty with the openings. So Stussy is our first card. Then I got the Miss Golden Week, Marianne. Got Black Maria. Got Charlotte Perospero. Kind of like this card in those yellow decks. It's a standard six for eight. Got Weakness is a Crime, or an Unforgivable Sin, I guess, in, in this one. Um, I don't remember if that's what he said in the Japanese, but in the dub it's a crime, punishable by death. Uh, got Viola, Violet, Hera, and Mr. Two, Bon Cure, I thought it was clay. And the Flamingo leader, that's actually very good. He's one of the best leaders in this set, if not the best in my eyes. And we get our rare Heavenly Fire, Golden Goddamn, and Miss Valentine, Mikita. Oh, and I get a special Dawn too. Nice. So I'm definitely using this, Vivi. Will you still call me your friend? Great stuff. So does this count like as a rare hollow super rare? Does this mean we're not going to get any alternate arts or I don't know? But yeah, it looks, it looks great. Very good. So put your asses here. So pack number two. Let's see if I can make it smoother. Um, just kind of ruin them. Anyway. So we got the giants now. Oi, oh, and Kashi. Got Tony Tony Chopper. Kamel, this bitch. Happiness Punch, yeah, that was a pretty cool scene. Pero Spero, Barrier. This guy, Koza, yeah, this guy was a dumbass, wasn't he? Dragon Twister, Vivi Leader. Uh, she's kind of cool as well. Um, 
can attack and the rush thing is kind of difficult to make use of but I mean I've been out of one piece I'm trying to just get all of my assets from my previous computer before I get back to one piece matches for the other channel got Keenum on and Mr. Five so this guy's a rare too pretty cool okay This method isn't the greatest, but it is easier, I guess. Was it like this on the Digimon packs too? I haven't realized. That's what I've been told. You got the Ice on me, you got Sanji, I like this dude. Um, his, you know, his classic outfit, the black sort of uh, suit. And uh, he's a 1-3K, or just a red, nice. You got this dumbass. Yasu, uh, five seven standard law could be cool. Rocky, hi, 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 Rudin, hi. How do you? I kind of like how they say it in the anime, but I can't really say it. The giant from Dressrosa, Usopp in the Alabaster Arc, King Kong, Treble. This guy sucks ass too. I mean they. They should have made, uh, they could have made more of his character. I think Ichiro Oda uh, it sort of hinted in the flashbacks that he's kind of like a kind of dude, but in the end he was a dumbass anyway. And I think we get something here and we get Sugar. Is this a super rare or is it? Yes, it is a super rare. So our first super rare. Uh, this can be an annoying card when I played against it in green decks. You have to get rid of it, otherwise he's going to keep resting your dudes. Nice. Nice hollow pattern. Okay, put you over here. Okay, I guess I got to just draw it out completely. I wonder if the cards get damaged. A Daddy Masterson. Yeah, he's blue, very old. It's kind of a good little card. I mean, 4-5. And you set him as active. I guess it needs a dawn, but it could be useful. Like Maria, Stasi, you, the weak, do not have the right to choose how they die. Kind of a nice quote as well from this guy. Randolph, this card is also a nice yellow one, 5 7 vanilla. Crocodile, yeah, this guy, I mean, both of the quotes are good. You know, there's a good amount of similarities between this guy and Flamingo. I like Crocodile more, of course. Moscato. This guy's a trigger, but the other effect isn't that useful. I mean, I guess it's Banish. I guess it can't be useful because you're gonna put it on, it's gonna be five. Uh, maybe. I didn't use him. Got baby five. Baby indeed. And Tueno Bastardo, pretty cool name. This guy's a cool attack. And we get Aurora Nora Zoro too. This is a a rare. It looks pretty sweet though. Uh, even though the effect, I mean, it's it's all right. Five six. You get the counter effect too. You basically, for one cost more, you get the sort of minus two thousand just once. So. I don't know, but it could be pretty good. Uh, yeah. Orlumbus. Kung Fu Jagon. Mr. 13 and Miss Friday. Nami with the titties. Uh, really nice from the Alabaster arc. So much good stuff going on. And uh, you, Toko, Queen. This guy, I, I always thought he was uh, a jackass. Yeah, I mean, Kaido doesn't have a lot of cool, like all of his crew isn't really cool. Big, Big Mom's crew, she has a lot of cool characters. And speaking of Queen, Next to your transform form, 
I guess this guy was an okay leader. Then we got Charlotte Amand in the island of the nuts and shit. Hazelnuts. Rare. And we get Bartolomeo too as a rare. I kind of like this guy as a blocker. You know, 3 3. And then 2000 counter. Just an excellent combination. Really good. But I mean, I guess he does specialize in blocking in the series as well. Gotta put some force between these, I guess. Damn. I'm trying to. Okay, let's see. Giola. Karu. Xinjia. This guy was so cool. The Dressosa arc. You know, OG. I like the sort of OG, you know, history aspects of One Piece. But I mean, it was pretty... It didn't make sense, this guy losing to that other old dude that we really don't know shit about. It, it wasn't that great. Uh, the G guy. But I suppose there must be a reason. Tom, good old Tom. Penis Punch. Otama. Solomon. Monkey D. Luffy. I kind of dug this card in the beginning, but I don't know right now if it's worth it to use, maybe. I mean, he is, uh, it just has Banish. I mean, that's a great effect, but for the cost, I don't know. Um, what was that just flew in my nose outside and distracted anyway? You get the Ness Palm Cannon. That's different from the Funimation type at least. And we get something. Okay, it's just a rare. Yeah, these cards, they look like they'd be something else with these gold borders. Okay. And a month. All right. I still think the cards can get damaged when you open it like that. Ah, why couldn't you be like the Yu-Gi-Oh packs? Yu-Gi-Oh packs, at least, they are always easy to open. Especially the new ones. Holy shit. Yeah, I knew something was gonna go wrong. All right, so, uh, let's see. <laughs> Embarrassing. So what do we got? Pick up all of the cards. And see what's up. I got this guy. Remember this guy, Eric? It was one of the early deaths in One Piece. Or at least we think. Iceberg, the banana gator, uh, this random marine dude, Chinjao, Odama, Barrier. Isho, another leader. Apis from the East Blue. Got a Happiness Punch. We got Ulti. And uh, Cavendish. This is a rare, once again. So I gotta be careful, but I'm not. I mean, it's. I'm recording, you know. I gotta be mindful of the tripod. I gotta be mindful of the angles. A bunch of things. I mean, if you do this, I know the cards are getting damaged. So, Kung Fu Jugan, Slice and Ice on me, Chopper, Idea. This guy's a 2 2 blocker as well, but I mean, I'd rather use. Um, um, ah, what's it called? Corazon. Um, I forgot his other name, but. Laws, um, Doflamingo's brother is a, a 2 2 1 as well as a blocker. Abyss Cobra Queen Hiori Lao Ji Ulti, and we get a Kaido. So, this is a super rare, he is supposed to be like a, a boss character, you know, top level card. But I don't, I never really liked him. I mean. You return a character of cost less 
and a, a, a character with a cost of three list. So you get that double return, double removal, but it's in the hand. And I don't know, man. I mean, of course, the one from OP5, the dragon that lets you draw three cards. I prefer that any day of the week. I guess this can be okay. They should have just made him you remove one, but it, it gets it gets spin in the deck, like Mihawk or something. Then it could have been better. But anyway, that's a super rare. Didn't get too many of these yet. So let me put you here. Okay. Keep going. I want to get some crocodile stuff and I want to get Nico Robin too, even if I don't use the purple crocodile deck. It'd still be good to get that stuff. Viola, Plague of Rounds, Long, Vertigo Dance. Oh yeah, this is uh, when um, VB did this. We only saw that once in like that cactus island. The first island they went through in the Grand Line basically. Gats, Mr. Five, and Zoro. Okay. Golden Week, Sanji, Kudo. Pretty tough for a guy that technically would be pretty weak, I guess. Um, well, by the point the characters are right now in the show. Nami, Mr. Three Galdino, Enchanting Vertigo Dance, Sulaiman, got Frankie, and what else? Sanji, pretty nice. So this guy's obviously a good yellow trigger. You know, blocker and five, summon for free from the life, of course. Well, you, you discard something, but I mean, it's a trigger. You guys know what I mean. I think it's one of the more expensive cards of the Super Seal. I don't know if it dropped in money now, but in my head, it's still a good card. Um, so, very good. Let's put you over here. It is a Super, right? Yeah. I mean, if it was just a gear, I don't think it'd be that expensive. To open properly again. These packs just don't. I mean, it's much more effective when I use the scissors, but that just takes up more time in me filming, cutting the video, doing stuff. So I wanted to try this method out. And okay, we got it open. Somehow. So Dellinger, the scene where he gets his ass kicked by uh, Cavendish was pretty cool. Uh, I guess I shouldn't spoil stuff. The uh, Rabayan, the Rag, Maria, Modegui, Miss Merry Christmas. Page one. Basically, page one, Ulti, and Black Maria are the only cool characters, like in my eyes at least, in Kaido's crew. I guess maybe if you want to count Yamato as well. Uh, technically, at one point he's a part of the crew. And maybe who's who, just maybe. Wow, G, you got Gungam, Red Rock, very good. Yeah, this is a, a great removal card. It's basically like the Terror Pit of One Piece, but instead of destroying, you put the card back in the deck, which is pretty good. Um, very, very nice. Excellent trigger card too. And is it? It's just a rare too. Man, hopefully we get a bunch of these. I need a play set. And what do I get? Motherfucker! Yamato. So I don't really use this card, but I know that it's one of the hottest, I think most expensive super rares from this set. Because it's playable in a bunch of stuff in like an L. So it's a nice, a great pick to get, I would say. It looks pretty nice too, the holo pattern. I don't know if the camera just does it justice, but looks really nice in person here. Yamato is really cool. 
Okay, I'm gonna say a spoiler now, so whatever. I mean, if people are watching this, they caught up with one piece, I think. It was pretty annoying when she didn't join the crew. Neither her nor um, Carrot. I wanted Carrot to join, but then if she didn't join, I'm like, okay, at least Yamato, because we need at least the third bitch in like the crew. I mean, you can't just have Nami and Robin, I mean, with so many other male characters, just give it a third chick. It will make things a little bit more interesting. Just, uh, it, w it would sort of change the dynamic, sort of, um, I don't know how to explain it. I think it would have been a welcome addition, but we didn't get anything. We just got Jinbei in the end. Get the Corita Coliseum, Christmas, Viola, Jack. Maybe this guy is all right from the crew, but not really of Kaido. I never thought it was that cool. Got Mac Vice, Ulti, and we get Don motherfucking Flamingo motherfucker. Yeah, great super rare as well. This card is busted. Every time my opponent plays this against me, I'm like, fuck. Just stun a bunch of characters and then they don't refresh broken ass stuff definitely a worthy boss character in a green deck very nice pull as well i mean i like crocodile more as a character but this guy is just a lot more useful compared to like the hollow boss crocodile character here so yeah we'll take it we will take it okay i still didn't get any like secret or full art but my super errors are really, really good, I want to say. I uh, get Tony Tony Chopper. Oh, great, and it got dark. Hopefully the lighting is going to be effective enough, but it really, it did get dark. Uh, it's really visible on the camera, too. I got Mr. Four. His name is Babe. That's so weird. Crocodile, the leader. I don't really dig this guy as much as the blue one and that's saying something because the blue one his effect I wish it was something else too But who knows maybe someday I'll be interested in using him uh, It's just the, the purple what they do with like the dawn manipulation It's just complicated stuff. I like playing simple stuff, you know simple effects like old-school Yu-Gi-Oh maybe Got Kinemon and we also get Chaka too. Is this a rare or? I think it's a rare, yeah. Uh, he's all right, I don't remember what it does. I think it's, um, it gives one opponent minus 3k. Yeah, I think it's better than the Pell, even though Pell is technically stronger, I guess, in the series. Anyway, like in the VV deck. Okay. And uh, I still got a fair amount of packs, I want to say. <sighs> I knew the weather wasn't going to be the greatest today, but if I didn't make the video today, I'd have to wait at least one more week. And I said, fuck it. We pay the price. Damn it, I just, I just really need, I rely a lot on the sun. These, uh, the lights that I got aren't that effective. But I don't want to buy anything more expensive now. Okay, Koza, Isho again. Damn, I thought you didn't get the leaders more than once in the set. You would get like one of each of them if you would buy a booster box. Or maybe if you miss one or I don't know, but I got this guy twice now, I think. Diamante, I think this guy's, um, okay, he's a rare. And, uh, his card is okay as well for green, but as a character, this guy sucks, everything he did. And we got Rebecca too, so is she a... She's a rare too, I believe this is your searcher. Fine bitch as well. Gotta hurry up, I think. Usab, Sasaki. Uh, Rebecca, and it's just a regular rare, yeah. Just a regular rare, and 
Senor Pig. This guy was super awesome. Uh, one of the coolest guys. He might just be the coolest guy in the Don Flamingo's crew. Nice backstory. I mean, I don't fully agree with the, his whole philosophies, but hose, but anyway. Okay. He was telling the bitches, get a guy younger than me. Ah, uh, maybe. So the Vivi like secret rares, they're not really anything great, but collectability wise, just because she looks so sexy, in one of them at least, I think one doesn't look that good, but I guess we'll have to pull them for me to find out. Remember, Crocodile again, so duplicates of the leaders. Uh, Miss Valentine, nice rare, and I get Bat Manor's Kick Course. I believe this is a rare. And the um, Dawn. Pretty sweet. Get another one of these. Okay. So I'm a, I'll put you here. I guess this counts as a special card, maybe. Yeah, the little thing got caught now. I mean, you can damage the cards with this method. annoying anyway not great they're doing construction outside too again <sighs> my damn neighbor I don't know if you guys can hear it okay who's who this is a rare and we get colors trap this is a rare as well pretty cool as well that little little garden arc I just really like a lot of the old school One Piece shit. Just the new stuff, they just don't have the same charm. I guess there's other benefits to the new arcs. But, you know, these super long arcs, like the Wano arc, I have a lot of problems with that. Just a lot of plot holes in my head. Uh, I put the whole cake out in the head, actually, compared to Wano. But I'll just leave it at that. Don't you the family, the whole crew. Flapping thread. Capone. It's a rare and we get something. We get something. Get diamante. Wait, what the fuck is? Okay, it says rare, but this artwork, I guess it's my sort of full art alternate art from the set. Why did it have to be this guy? I don't like this guy. He sucks. Um, damn, that's a pretty thick card. Ugh, it had to be you. Anyway, I guess that's my full art. We probably won't get anything. Like at best, I'll get one more secret rare and another full art. I believe you only get like two. All right, our Lumbus. Video is 30 minutes long, damn. And uh, we get Jaka again. Still got a few packs, but The Super Spot Build Duck Troops. Man, these weren't the damn names. Like, not in the Funimation dub and not like in the Japanese subtitled versions that I watch. Diable Jambe, Joe Shot. This is when he hits, uh, yeah. Got Rebecca, Searcher, Be Good Together, and uh, Treble again. The other pick. Okay, how many packs do I got? Damn.
So I guess when it tears through completely down, then it's smooth, but when it doesn't, it's still hard to open. Kiros, this is a rare, and then we get another Sanji. Okay, duplicate, but I guess it's a good card if I build the yellow deck in real life. Nice super rare to get. Let's put you here. Can't forget. Okay, and I think I got like what? Um, three packs or four packs left maybe? We want to get a big hit. Give me the VV. Leo, I think this is my first dude. Um, uncommon. Jaka and uh, Pell. Okay, this is a super rare. Now, this card looks very cool, but I think Jaka has a better effect for the most part. Uh, but it's a super. I think this is one of the worst supers you can get from here, but I guess uh, we can't get the perfect pulls. We can't complain. I got other great supers. So, gotta get a dud every now and then. Uh, yes, he is a super, so we're putting you here. and faster I guess under 40 minutes maybe it'll be good enough king and I think this is gonna be my like secret or something and it is uh, Rosinante yeah that was the name I was trying to remember okay secret rare is not Vivi I mean it's either him or her you're gonna get um, I don't really remember his effect I think is um, well I'm not gonna read it we're gonna waste time it's an okay thing to get, I guess, maybe more playable than Vivi. Um, he's a great character, of course. His arc was just amazing. Cried like a little bitch, I'm sure everyone did. So this means that this is um, the last major pull. So we'll take it. I don't know if I'm gonna get like another super rare. There's one pack left. So one pack magic, as Rookson says. Let's see if we can make it happen. Can we make it happen? What do we get? Limbus, Karu, Tom, Kuro, Motiki, Nami, Ducks, this dumbass, Dragon Twister, King, and I get something! It's the motherfucking Sanji motherfucker! Wait, this is, yeah, this is another alternate art. Holy fuck. It's the same as the other dude, the same effect trigger, but I mean, he's wearing like his white suit. This is like during the wedding. Golden ass, beautiful secret rare, or alternate art. Perfect. Okay, so I'll, I'll show you guys the total pulls now. All right, guys, so my pulls were really solid, uh, I wanna say. We got our standard secret rare, Don't Kyo de Rosinante. I got like two other Alternate arts slash full arts, however you're supposed to say them. Uh, Diamante, a bad one, and Sanji, a really great one, I want to say. Uh, competitive, cool, and uh, yeah, expensive basically. But it's just a great thing to get, I want to say. And then I got one, two, three, four, five, six super rares, I think. It, yeah. I uh, got double of the regular Sanji, got Flamingo pretty good, Pell as well. Uh, Kaido and then the sugar So I believe yeah, that's um, one two three four five six. Yeah, and uh, two of the special dawns uh, Vivi Crying to her friends um, I'm gonna put these in different sleeves. That's why I didn't sleeve them, but I think you're not guaranteed to get uh, a bunch of these or maybe I don't have a clue but getting two is nice and uh, that's basically it. I mean, standard pulls, nine total. Uh, I think it's standard, I'm pretty sure. And I'm mostly satisfied. 
Wait a minute, actually I'm missing a card. Uh, shit, actually yeah, where is Yamato? Damn, I didn't, I guess she's in the bulk. Okay, we got Yamato as well. I don't have her around now, but I got the Yamato as well. Right. But that's the opening, guys. I'm really pleased. Thanks again to Alpha Training Card Games for the booster box. And um, hope you guys enjoyed the opening. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a like. Share the video with your friends. And I'll see you guys next time. What a year.